Hello everyone and welcome to our another show of a successful career transition. So today we have uh, Mr. Onik Mukhopadhyay here uh, and he'll be sharing his experience over his successful career transition. So let's welcome Onik Mukhopadhyay on this platform. Yeah, hi Nia, hi all. So my name is Onik Mukhopadhyay and I am from West Bengal. I did my B.Tech in 2016 in civil engineering. And uh, the, right now I'm working as a lead data scientist in a mine tree. So uh, after uh, completing my B.Tech on, in 2016 from West Bengal University of Technology, I started my career as a civil engineer. One year I worked uh, in a private company. So after that, I realized that uh, I did, after completing my B.Tech, what um, growth I expecting that much growth I did not get. Okay, so that the, in that time I I thinking about to change my career path. So then later I uh, did uh, intern on in a Python uh, in a Hyderabad. So I worked here, and then after completing my post graduation uh, from NIT Warangal jointly with Edurega, then I uh, joined as a lead data scientist on a mine. So that's so, pretty much about. Okay, great. So basically, your current this, your cho your choice of career transition was basically because you were expecting a growth what you were working previously, as you said. You were looking for a growth yes. after your graduation, but you're not getting that. So you chose to like pursue a course where you can experience, where you can enhance and upskill yourself and grow as well and change your job to a better company where you have to where where you can actually match all your requirements and where they can grow in, in that company as well. So yeah, yes. I know like everybody knows that career transition is not only a difficult uh, task, but also like thinking it about it. Like you were working somewhere, but you thought about like, no, I'm not, I'm not, actually, I'm not happy with the job. I'm not growing. I'm not like, mm. I'm not able to use my skills. So let's upskill myself. So like, when did you plan it? Or like, when did you realize that you were going to like do this career transition part? Because I have some interest in a data science and I thought I, I am believing myself that I can learn uh, some something on Python or uh, uh, some tool. So then I can. Uh, so that's why I thought I can. I can. I can change my uh, career into the IT domain. As because uh, in these days, I can t tell you that IT has a lot or uh, lot to off offer, including uh, numerous job opportunities, competitive salaries, and work-life balance are more there. Okay, so that's why I thought um, I can start it off. Okay, uh, first I I did not uh, think about because uh, I know I'm from civil, so I I did not expect anything uh, first. But uh, uh, later I realized that if I get comfortable uh, in Python, I first learn I uh, first I learn in Python. Then I thought then I now I can change my career into the uh, data science part. Okay, so basically before joining the Edureka, okay, I know little bit about uh, in Python and in a SQL something in Tableau, just just little little bit of, okay. But uh, after uh, after finishing this course, okay, then I uh, get a good chance in a, a in a big MNC companies and. Then I uh, recently I uh, cracked a job uh, in a, in my So right now I'm working as a lead data scientist. So thankful to Edureka. So I know it's a difficult decision, but if you need to grow in your life, so you need to take a difficult decision. Okay, then you can grow. So that's, that's absolutely good. That's absolutely good. So your experience was being from a non-technical background being a civil engineer and having a basic interest in the technical field and joining these uh, like after your edureka course you joined the mnc company basically like whole soul depending upon your python like what you learned from the uh, from the program that you chose with us what made you think about like okay edureka is a platform where i can join where i can learn this because so why edureka uh, looking after this uh, course, I saw there that there is they uh, given us uh, lots of um, opportunities like uh, they uh, they give us support lifetime. Okay, they have the lifetime support and uh, also uh, the module 
they uh, the, the the module they have actually it's very um, useful for us to learn in data science uh, machine learning deep learning in these days you need to know uh, all those things then you can get a good job okay so also uh, also why i choose this uh, edureka because uh, uh, this course actually joined with the nit uh, warangal okay uh, so that's a good thing for this uh, course okay so actually i got alumni in edureka or as well as uh, in nit warangal also okay that's so cool. that's why that's the reason i choose edureka so edureka always ensure that uh, each one of our uh, in a, their live courses uh, community uh, uh, in a live projects with the real world uh, real life data sets uh, giving you the sneak into what really in store so uh, i got some varieties uh, i thought uh, i can uh, go with this course so uh, because i have some Uh, idea on uh, data science before joining the edureka i search on google and every in other social media that uh, data science ha has a uh, i mean great opportunity to uh, build a career okay so like uh, as we know on it there are many people who think about a career transition but are not able to achieve it why do you think so like why do not why do they not be able to achieve why do they think that it's difficult they did plan it they did think about it that i need to grow but they're not able to achieve it so like do you have any uh, input about this of course and um, i'm honestly says after completing uh, my civil engineering i did not think i can change my career into data science part okay i did not think but actually it's very difficult okay because i have some interest in it okay i love with the computer i love with the technical things okay data science machine learning deep learning robotics nlp those are very interesting thing okay always i i thought in whenever i working as a civil engineer but my focus always on that okay so i did not think okay i did not expecting that that much uh, high uh, that much growth i can get uh, i will get but yes uh, absolutely i already cracked the uh, job uh, and i'm working in a reputed company uh, mindtree is a very good company i can say uh, and uh, that's because i i mean you need to believe in yourself okay if you if you have focus if you know that you can do with your uh, you, you can learn more in data science i mean if you have some interest na then you can achieve okay otherwise you can i can say right yes and uh, before uh, i can say because they i mean people thought that they are fresher they uh, do uh, they completed bitang in a different domain okay but how can i do but up, up, just start to, just start to learn in, in in any tool like python i i just started learning first python whenever i get comfortable then i started internship okay after completing my internship i got permanently chance in a company uh, a private company in hyderabad after four years i learned there but that time i did not know about the data science everything okay this a list of no uh, knowledge i have that time okay but after this course after within a three month you can see that uh, within a three month i got that chance big chance so okay, that's, that's why i am telling you. yeah that's a great advice for the viewers who are watching this video like you'll have to believe in yourself before making a decision about the career transition so yeah that was mm -hmm. a great advice to the viewers so let's move forward like uh, after you cracked the job or your dream job that you were looking for after your graduation in civil engineering how did you feel how did it affect you as a person after the transition like what was the experience after that so whatever i think uh, after joining the uh, joining in a uh, company okay uh, first of all i thought i can't do okay <laughs> because uh, it's very new for me okay i have that time only the knowledge okay i did not have any experience but after joining the uh, joining in a company na the manager always support you okay i learn there okay a, you need to learn uh, uh, slowly but you can okay 
so yes the experience is really good their experience okay. is really good and i am really thankful to edureka okay because uh, i can thankful um, i really thankful uh, one of the instructor i need to tell uh, his name his name is usab chakravarti okay and uh, because uh, he is my idol okay i learn a lot from him uh, so uh, okay so he always support me that's why i got the chance i can truly speak so that's yes that's a very the good great thing experience to say. I have. that's yeah. a great experience to share so last but not the least uh, uh, onyx what is the suggestion to the people who are watching this stream that they should how should they start their journey for the career transition how should they start like Well, how should they uh, think about the career transition? Like any suggestion for the viewers? Like you started, you did a great job in your career transition. You got a great company. You're working it right now. So, any suggestions for the viewers who are watching this stream? Yes, uh, I want to suggest people that uh, don't panic. Okay, if you if you work in uh, if you uh, did your uh, Uh, i mean did your your graduation or be take in any other domain and and you need to and and you want to change your career path so just go for it okay just go for it just uh, started learning on uh, smaller things which is related to data science okay the python then sql then tableau whatever the machine learning things and uh, you just need to learn first okay you need to learn and then uh, slowly you can uh, take some courses like edureka or any other uh, those who have the, so in this way you can uh, uh, you can grow in your career okay uh, you uh, whenever you have knowledge you don't have to worry about it there is many more companies infinite it companies okay Correct. they are ready to take you okay right. so just think on that okay believe in yourself and go for it that's a very good advice then that's a very great suggestion thank you so much onik for, for being here and inspiring our viewers with your with your great career transition story and experience